Hi Scorpio, welcome to another love reading of yours. This is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. I'm so sorry I started your reading and for some reason it just completely blanked out. So I'm going to restart the reading and I have the cards laid out in front of you. Alright, so we're going to start. Alright, so in your current situation I have the Ten of Pentacles. The Ten of Pentacles is abundance, security, stability, okay, and it's a lot of, I mean, Probably this is a lot of financial abundance also, but Ten of Pentacles to me in this love reading, it seems to be a lot of stability and security either within oneself or this is coming in towards you, okay? Scorpio, this is, I'm going to read this as your side and this is the person you're dealing with. Please, 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 please feel free to flip the sides, all right? Do not ask me in the comments if this needs to be flipped. Yes, it can be flipped, all right? If this is what you are and this is the person you're dealing with, awesome, all right? Uh, Scorpio, the reason I'm reading this as Scorpio is because I, I don't want to uh, get this confused, all right? Scorpio, Knight of Cups, this is what's on your mind, okay? You want to apologize to this person or you want to go towards this person, express yourself emotionally, okay? The Knight of Cups looks like an apology, could be because with the Ten of Swords in reverse on this person's side, this person is trying to heal or they're trying to recover from something that ended badly, okay? This could be this person who probably was the one who felt backstabbed and betrayed, Okay, this is a lot of overkill, a lot of depression, okay, someone feeling like a victim. This person is trying to come out of that energy, okay, they're trying to heal from that, okay. It's like they're trying to, uh, again, I'm, tr I'm getting uh, someone who's trying to rise, rise up from the ashes, okay. They're trying to get their shit together, alright. Okay, but the emperor in reverse on this person's, on Scorpio side, okay, you, you are finding it really, really hard to release control over the situation, release control, okay, you always probably are someone who always wants to take control of a situation or this is you who always wants the upper hand in every situation, okay, I have a very bad feeling that this is going to be like a reverse reading as usual, but well, it is what it is, okay, so maybe the message is for the cross watcher, so the emperor in reverse, you're right, Scorpio, you're having a very hard time, releasing control you're being a control freak okay this is like someone who's very hard to budge i think this is not only angry but this is also someone very very ego okay very egoistic so that's a lot of egoism and that's arrogance okay and at the same time again someone who just wants to control the situation anyhow they on the other side with the lovers here this person is in love with you all right they feel a strong soulmate connection to you with the lovers here yes this person does have choices but i don't feel like this person has choices i feel this is someone who feels this strong soulmate connection to you a strong soul type connection to you okay it's like and, and this person is like they love you they want you okay and they they feel a strong bond towards you but the problem here is that you in your emotions you're just it's like logically you know that you need to approach this person but emotionally it's just <coughs> you're just not being able to do that because for you it's like you know what it's my way or the highway you come to me or you know i'm not going to apologize etc etc and your emotions okay right now your heart is overruling your uh, head this person they're taking things very logically and it's like they know things have ended between you and them okay and now they're trying to it's almost like they're trying to rise themselves up from whatever happened in the past between you guys again this person could have been someone who's extremely hurt very very hurt okay but yeah again they're trying to get out of that entire trauma and they're trying to rise themselves on their own okay but this person has a lot of love for you okay the lovers is not just a card that is felt from one person okay it's a very mutually felt card you know so probably they also know that you're also someone who feels this strong soul like connection to them okay but probably you're not opening up or you don't want to because with emperor in reverse here you want things to be in your control you want to run um the situation whenever you feel like in your on your terms okay with the six of cups in reverse this is your attitude you're holding a grudge against this person it could be very well that you and this person ended things with you okay because of whatever they were going through right they were feeling very backstabbed and betrayed they were feeling things were not fair with them okay and they, they wanted justice things were not fair it could be one-sided situation with the justice here maybe this person wanted commitment over the ten of pentacles or this person wanted a lot of stability security and growth with you and maybe you were not wanting to give this to them or they were just not want <coughs> or you were just not wanting to open up emotionally You still aren't emotionally. I mean, in your emotions, you're still shut down. You're not giving something a logical approach. You're holding a grudge against this person. Okay, it's like something's... I'm getting with the Six of Cups here. Um, something's left a bad taste in your mouth. Let's say that. Or 
it could also be that you're clinging on to the bad memories. Maybe you didn't really like the fact that this person let you go. Maybe you're in shock. Maybe you didn't expect this person to move on. Maybe you didn't expect this person to release you from them. Okay, and that's one of the reasons why you're so mad at them. This is someone who's just very angry, pissed off. Again, holding on to bad memories. All right. They on the other side with the lovers here. Uh, I don't think this person is in any mood of reconciliation right now with the three of swords here. This person is hurting. They feel hurt. I mean, again, they have swords on their side, for God's sake. That's a lot of mental stuff, okay? That's a lot of mental issues. Not mental issues, but that's a lot of mental trauma that this person is going through. They're really, really hurt. But in their heart, they're in love with you. Look at how you're behaving in your emotions. Emperor in reverse, you still are not learning your lessons, Scorpio. Still not. You both want the Ace of Wands. You both want this brand new beginning, okay? You won't want a clean slate. Anyways, with the likely outcome with the justice here, I like this. It's because this justice is, again, bringing balance into the situation, okay? Equal give and take, restoring balance in the situation. And with the justice here, Six of Cups. Probably this person is coming back to you, Scorpio. You're going back to this person, okay? But looks like a reconciliation but yeah this person now i think this person scorpio if you're the one who was not offering this person long-term commitment or whatever i think now this person is you're going towards this person or they're coming towards you look like it looks like you're the one who's making this effort and going towards them with a love offer okay with the ten of pentacles ace of wands and justice here it's awesome there's passion there's stability here and there's justice here that's good cool. let's see why is the Ten of Pentacles as the current situation? Why I feel that you're making this offer because the Knight of Cups is looking at the Ten of Pentacles, alright? Why is the Ten of Pentacles here as the current situation? coming towards you with a high level of commitment either this person um, probably in the past year with the justice in reverse this person things were not fair and there was again something was imbalanced they were not fair to you they didn't get you what give you what you deserved again lack of equal give and take one person could have been more emotionally involved into the connection than the other maybe one person wasn't expecting things to get so serious or there was just one person who wanted to keep things as friend zoning you probably or this person was just very casual about the relationship or you were just in a situation ship. but right now i feel with the ten of pentacles and the high different here i think someone's being spiritually guided towards you scorpio or you're being guided towards them and now with the ten of pentacles and the high friend this is all about marriage this is all about commitment spirituality it's a very spiritually guided connection they're coming in scorpio you're going in actually <laughs> someone's going in with this and giving the other person what they always wanted what is the Knight of Cups? Clap for the Knight of Cups. Eight of Pentacles, you're not ready to put in the work in this connection, okay? This is investment, effort, putting in your hard work, okay? And wanting to work on yourself or wanting to work on this connection. After this person is out. What is the Eight of Pentacles? want a brand new beginning with this person okay you want a renewal in love you are in awe you're in love with this person you're in love with this person Scorpio you want everything with this person you want them to be your end all be all okay I can't say much this is what it is you're ready to put in the effort now you're ready to apologize or you're ready to open up emotionally maybe in the past you were not wanting to be vulnerable okay it's all happening now why is the ten of swords in reverse here I don't think this person's expecting it. Why is the Ten of Swords in reverse? Because this person is probably now with <coughs> now with the Six of Pentacles here. I think this person is trying to find balance within themselves. Okay, they're trying to heal and they're trying to find a balance within themselves. Could be that this person is probably they're not pro they're not expecting anything from you. They're not expecting you to come back. And I think this person is going towards balance they're wanting to find a relationship which gives them that balance gives them that equal give and take what is the six of pentacles two of cups in reverse but this person feels very very disconnected with you there's a lot of love here guys for sure but you guys are not seeing eye to eye and this person can feel it 
this person can feel it. They love you, but they're just they just feel that you both don't have you guys don't share the same goals in the relationship, and that's why with the six of pentacles, you're right. This person is this person is trying to find that balance within themselves, or they're okay finding going out and finding a relationship which is going to give them balance. What's what's the emperor in reverse? Four of Wands in reverse. See? See, this is exactly what I'm saying. You are not being able to, you know, you, in your emotions, you're being a control freak, okay? And that is one of the biggest reasons why this person is not being able to give you, a, to find that stability and harmony within the connection. Maybe that's one of the reasons, okay, that you're not being able to get together with this person on the same page. What is the Four of Wands in reverse? Queen of Cups in reverse. And now this person is probably just emotionally shut down. It's only because you're being a control freak. Only because you want the upper hand in every single time that you do, every single thing that you do. That's why there's so much instability within the connection, okay? And this person is feeling it with the Queen of Cups in reverse here. <coughs> or this could also be you who's emotionally unavailable again. Oh, you're just emotionally shut off. But I'm not feeling that. I'm feeling probably this person is emotionally shut down and you feel that this person has shut the door on your face okay and now you're just going crazy you don't know how to control the situation you feel the control the situation is out of your control and with the queen of cups in reverse so you feel this person you feel this person shut down you feel they're emotionally unavailable and they're not giving you the attention that you always wanted or they're just not being compassionate towards you this is that lack of unconditional love but i'm getting someone who's very very hurt and all this only because lack of stability within the connection. You know, it could also be one second with, um, uh, I'm thinking that with the Emperor in reverse and uh, the Four of Wands in reverse, I feel that you could have always shown this person that, you know what, I'm okay on my own. I don't need you. If, if you're gone, that's fine. I'll get someone else. So it was always that energy that you used to put in, but now with the four of wands in reverse, that veil has been lifted, okay? You realize the truth. You realize that this was the one for you. And you cannot lie, you cannot act, you can't put up and act anymore. And you feel this person is probably someone you cannot control anymore. They're emotionally shut off. <clears throat> Why is the lovers here? the lovers here where's the lovers here two of swords oh my god this person is so hurt they're so hurt scorpio three of swords this person loves you like crazy but they're so hurt over whatever happened in the past with the three of swords why is the three of swords here why is the three of swords here too many cards Death in reverse. In their emotions, so you know what? Logically, yes, they realize that things have ended between you guys. Logically, their logic asks them to move forward. Their logic asks them to move forward towards a relationship which gives them which gives them that equal give and take, which gives them a balance. So they're trying to bring a balance in their life, okay? Maybe earlier they were too focused on you, okay? And now they're very focused on themselves and their career, their money, their family, everything, okay? They're trying to find a balance within themselves, okay? After feeling very backstabbed and betrayed, right? Emotionally, in the logic mind, I think by their mind, they know that there's this disconnection, right? They're not even expecting you to come back. They're okay on their own. They're trying to find a balance. Like, I'm, I'm getting this person's trying to gather the pieces that are left and they're trying to move on. But in their emotions, this person loves you so much. With the death and reverse, this person refuses to let things in between you guys. It kills them to end it, but they just don't want to because again, they feel this connection with you. They know you are the one for them and you are the other hand, right? You're picking up on that energy because this person is so hot, they're just not opening up to you. Why is the Ace of Wands in reverse? You, the only reason I think is that you feel things are out of control because this person has probably shut the door on your face with the Four of Wands in reverse here. You feel they just close the door, slammed on the face forever, for good. Why is the Ace of Wands here? 
Eight of Cups, see? Eight of Cups in reverse. You both want this passionate beginning. You both are in that get set go mode, you know, and you both can't walk away with Eight of Cups in reverse here. I thought this is someone who's wanting to return back or this is someone who just never was been able to walk away. I mean, with the Emperor in reverse, you're the kind of person that you're being Scorpio. It's just a show. And this person is catching on it, okay, with the Three of Swords. This person, it's, it's killing them. It's killing them to realize that, I mean, you're not coming back or things are not going to happen between you guys. They can't walk away. You can't walk away. You both want this. And I think, Scorpio, you're spiritually being guided to this Ten of Pentacles, okay? You've learned your lessons. You both probably learned your lessons, okay? But this person does not want to end things in their emotions. They don't want to. As much as it kills them, but with the lovers here, they really, really want this union. They really want to be with you. They love you. They want you. All right. Why is the Six of Cups in reverse? Why is the Six of Cups in reverse? Why is the Nine of Wands in reverse? How is it going to be fair and balanced, Scorpio, if you're not going to make the move? We have the Six of Cups in reverse with the Nine of Wands in reverse and the Page of Wands in reverse. You probably, I'm feeling that probably, you know what, Scorpio, you're probably trying to make a move towards this person. So your attitude is, of course, right, you will hold a grudge against this person because probably this person ended things with you, right? You're not in any, you're not in a good mood with this person. You're very angry with them, okay? Your ego is high up, okay? You're stuck in your ego. But then, you know what? I like your approach with the Nine of Wands in reverse. You're letting your guards down, okay? You're no more wanting to uh, be guarded against this person again. You could be the one who was emotionally very vulnerable, not wanting to be vulnerable, someone who had trust issues, okay? Probably that could have been one of the biggest reasons why this person walked away or why things didn't work out between you guys. Maybe you were just not wanting to open up and not wanting to take things to the next level or whatever. You just wanted to keep it very casual or friend zone. But with the Page of Pentacles in reverse here, I'm getting Scorpio, maybe you're trying to make an effort towards this person. But you're, but you're procrastinating. Oh yes, I want to do this. Oh, oh yes, I want this person back. Oh yes, I want to talk to them, okay? I think you're not making a move at all. Or you're making a move, right? You're wanting to let your guards down. But I think your problem here is that you're not making a proper approach towards this person, okay? You want to offer stability, okay? But what you're offering is not stable. It's a very immature move towards this person. And that's one thing that this person probably is not wanting to be in a cycle with. Okay. It's a very immature approach towards stability. Okay. It's like, I think you want to make things happen, but I think you feel that you're feeling this difficulty getting things off ground. All right. And it's probably because you're catching on this person's feelings with the queen of cups in reverse here that this person shut the door. They're never going to let you in and they're emotionally unavailable. Okay. And maybe it's feeling you very depressed or you love this person, but you're suppressing your emotions. Why is the Three of Swords here? Why is the Three of Swords here? Why is the Three of Swords here? Eight of Wands in reverse. You both not talking. Why is the Eight of Wands in reverse? Page of Cups in reverse. See? You're the page of pentacles in reverse. You want to move towards them, but with stability, but you're not making that right offer towards stability, not making a right approach. I'm getting uh, Scorpio, you're making things more difficult than they seem. Okay. You're just being very manipulative right now. You want everything, but you don't want to make a move towards this person. You're thinking. It could also be that you're doubting yourself of whether you can make this happen with them or not. Okay. This person, on the other hand, they're just hurt, 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 and hurt with three of swords, three of swords here. Okay. In their emotions and their attitude towards you. It's like, you cut, you cut them through deep. You cut them through really deep, Scorpio. They cannot bear the pain. And with Eight of Wands in reverse here, I think this person is in no mood of being communicative with you. I don't think they're going to make the first move, Scorpio. If you're waiting for them to approach you, if they wanted to, they could, but they're holding back. Because with the Page of Cups in reverse here, I feel this person sees things for what they are. They, they, have, a, they have like a reality check of what's exactly going on. Agreed. Earlier, probably this person, they realized that things were going, moving forward very well. Or maybe you could have given them a lot of ideas, a lot of uh, 
signs from your side that yeah things are going to move forward and things are all great and we're good to go and we're good together and it's going to move forward we're going to you know blah 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 even if not this person could have had a lot of hopes and expectations from you that yes you will take things to the next level because things could have been great between you guys we are the two cups here for god's sake but i think they have a reality check now they're suppressing their emotions this person suppressing their emotions they're not ready to open up. This time, they don't want to be vulnerable, Scorpios. If you're wanting them to be vulnerable, no. Nope. They're not going to be vulnerable. They're not going to open up. No no matter what happens in their emotions, they don't want things to end. They want this to revive back, okay? They want a rebirth. They don't want to end this cycle, okay? Because they love you so much with the lovers here, okay? But it's the hurt, the pain. It's hurting. They're hurting, by the way. So I don't know who this is. With the page of cups and rivers, they're not going to communicate. They're not going to communicate. They're unapologetic about whatever happened between you guys because they feel that wrong was done for them. You, on the other hand, you want everything with them, okay? But you're not making that move. Make that proper move, Scorpio. It's not going to work otherwise. Why is the justice here as the likely outcome? Knight of Wands and Ace of Pentacles in reverse for the justice. <laughs> So I feel that with the Knight of Wands here, I think that there is going to be communication that's going to be rushed in. Maybe you'll just land up communicating with them. But again, with the Knight of Knight of Wands, it's a very in and out, in and out energy. Okay. You're wanting to rectify a situation. You're wanting to make a bad situation good with the justice here. Yes. You're wanting to rush in. But again, you're being a knight here. What the hell? You've gone through a big breakup. You've gone through a separation. This is not something small. We have the Ten of Swords here. Two of Cups, it's a beautiful energy, it's in the reverse. This is two people who were in love with each other once, okay? But now they don't find that connection. Because they're not seeing eye to eye, you guys are not on the same page, not on the same goals. Scorpio, if you need to communicate with this person, A, yes, you need communication. B, you cannot be the Knight of Wands, you cannot be the Page of Pentacles. I don't think so. Page still, okay, but Knight of Wands, the way you're approaching the situation, wanting to rush in, wanting to, you know, like in and out. This is again a very insincere energy. That's why with the Ace of Pentacles in reverse here, this person is still not going to, I don't think they're going to entertain any kind of communication if they realize that you're coming in with that Knight of Wands energy. If you're going to be like, hey babe, what's up? Like, I miss you, blah, blah, blah. They're going to shut you off. They want you to come. I mean, it's not that they want you, but if you really want to make things work out, this person is still there. They still don't want things to end. But if you want to make this work out, you're going to have to come in like, okay, you're going to come in to have and make a very mature approach towards the situation. I don't see a king here anywhere. I do see the emperor here and that's also in the reverse. Your approach towards the situation is fucked up. It's very bad. Cross watcher, if this is you, yes, that's why there's a delay in this beginning or that's why it's a missed opportunity. You have a very good opportunity to start something new with this person to start and get into that commitment or whatever, right? It's still, there's a delay here because of your approach with the Knight of Wands here. This is in and out, in and out, in and out. You're wanting to make this, this could be Scorpio, this could be your way or approaching a situation or making a situation right, okay? By rushing in, saying what you have to and leave or just coming in with that insincere, you know, not genuine energy. That's not how it works. That's not how the Ace of Pentacles is going to be right. Ace of Pentacles is a card. It is an energy where something needs a lot of effort, investment growth, uh, your hard work, potential, everything that you say, it's got to have all this to get this off ground. You're going to come in with that lame knight of wands? I don't think so. It's not going to work out. You're approaching justice. You're wanting to make things right. But with the with your approach with the knight of wands here? No. Yeah. I don't think so. And that's probably with the three of swords. This is what this person hates. Probably that's what's on their mind with the Six of Pentacles. This person wants that equal give and take. This person wants you to be as mature as them. They want you to approach the situation as maturely as they do. And that's what they're not getting. That's why they feel the Two of Cups in reverse. They feel disconnected. They don't feel that you are with them on the same page. There is a lot of love here, guys. There is a lot of love here. You, on the other hand, you're wanting to suppress your emotions, okay? You're suppressing them. They're suppressing it. You feel that they've shut the door on your face. Yes, but then, you know, logically you want to work towards this. But emotionally and your approach towards this situation, that's a very bad approach. Page of Pentacles, of course, very bad approach. It's just n almost offering this person nothing. It's like an empty, it, it's giving an empty offer. 
not the right thing to do. Not the right thing to do. And all this is happening, I guess, because you're holding a grudge against this person. Okay. So that's what I have for you, Scorpio. Tomorrow, we'll make this work out. Communication has to be very, very stable, and it has to come in the right, correct way. Otherwise, there's still going to be a missed opportunity or a delay in a beginning between you guys. Okay. So that's what I have for you and uh, I hope this reading resonates with you. Leave your comments below and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.